Alright, so for today's show, I'm going to be showing you how to make a whistle out of an aluminum Genesis arrow. So what you're going to need, you're going to need a wooden dowel that will fit um, it's about the a little smaller than the diameter of the arrow. Um, you need a hacksaw to cut the arrow and file or sandpaper to smooth down the cut edges. Um, and you're going to need an arrow, preferably one that isn't bent or otherwise destroyed. And I'm going to use the front since there's already a handy plug there, which is the point. And so I'm just going to put this in the clamp right here. And you should make your whistle about three inches long at most. I found that that size works well. Alright, and just gonna spin this up a bit. Alright, so. And you. So, first of all, while this is still in the clamp, you want the little notch this thing, the little notch in the whistle, be about cut halfway down the diameter of the arrow and about maybe half third of an inch away from the opening. And so yeah. So sort of cut at a 45 degree angle for your second cut. Alright, so we've got the notch cut in there. I'm going to proceed to cut the actual whistle. Three inch mark. Alright. So we have this right here. And now, I cut this earlier so I wouldn't have to dollar. But I'm going to insert this little plug of wood from a dowel in there. The flat side facing up. It needs to be firmly in there, else it won't. Or else it might fall. Alright, so I've gotten that little plug of wood in there. Um, you can see. Right there, I don't know if the camera can. It's going to proceed to file all the sharp edges so you don't cut yourself when you're using it. Now it's time for the test. Hey, actually works pretty well. Um, you can obviously, you know, buff it up or whatever, spiff it up, make that a cleaner cut um, with better equipment. So this is actually a pretty nice little whistle, fun project to make. Please leave a like, subscribe, smash that like um, button, hit the bell. Thank you so much for watching.